Alright guys, pretty big one today. Pretty big one. Now that we really only do the big ones, uh, this is definitely one we had to do. Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. Now, for those of you that know me, your boy knows nothing about Star Wars. I've never seen any of the movies. I know, that's usually a fist fight on site. I've been beat up a lot. Anyway, um, $50 game. Now let me tell you something. Lego games have been around since I was a kid. But out of all the games that have drastically changed all the time, uh, drastically changed over time, this is one of them. These went from very linear games to giant open world games, and this is one of those. Um, I don't know if you guys have played, the last one I played was the Marvel one, uh, the Marvel superhero one, which was really good. 100% of it, no big deal, it took me like a year. But uh, this one has 23 different planets, planets we can travel to, which are all open worlds as well as um, 300 characters. It's the most characters we've ever had in a Lego Star Wars game, or Lego game in general, I believe. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited. We're gonna go through all nine games. Well, for the video, we're gonna go through like a couple levels, but you know, I'm gonna go through all nine games, learn some Star Wars, about time. So let's just send it, see how it is. Oh, so it goes by episode. So for those of you that don't know, oh, they're doing it in chronological order. So one thing I know about Star Wars, just to blow your mind, so the original movies that came out in the 70s, 80s, 90s, those were the middle three. And then later on, when I was born, the first three in the set came out. And now there's three more that I've never seen. Well, I've never seen any of them, but you know. A New Hope. Yes, start this episode. Oh, I am playing with a PS4 controller. I used to play these with mouse and keyboard, but then I realized it was not the best idea. Come on, I just want to get to the part where I bang my sister. Come on. <laughs> a New Hope. In a period of civil war, rebel spaceships striking from a hidden base have won their first victory against the evil Galactic Empire. During the battle, rebel spies managed to steal secret plans to the Empire. Empire's ultimate weapon, the Death Star, an armored space station with enough power to destroy an entire planet pursued by the Empire's sinister agents. Princess Leia raced home aboard her starship, custodian of the stolen plans that can save her people and restore freedom to the galaxy dude hey whose idea was it to have this text go that way george lucas figure it out figure it out now i actually played the original star lego star wars games so i don't know if these are like remastered versions of those games or if they completely rebuilt the levels it'll be interesting but for 50 bucks i don't know Whoa, man, these Lego games are getting so pristine. Now, your boy is a completionist, as you guys know. Um, I will be breaking everything and getting all of the coins. Oh, whoa, we can, like, aim and stuff, too, now? What's the attack button? Okay. Oh, wow, it plays like, uh... Wow, they've really updated these games. God, I feel so old! <laughs> Now let me tell you, aiming with a controller Surprise, is motherfucker. not. Oh, ow! What the what the fuck was that? It's gonna be. Wait, is this Darth Vader? Oh no, never mind. Sorry. Elder. Dude, my shots are on fleek. God, how do people aim on controller with no aim assist? Holy shit! Or I'll be like Call of Duty where I just bumper spam. <laughs> there he is. I was right. It is Vader. And I believe that is technically our father, but she doesn't know yet. Spoilers! Spoilers from a movie that's 30, 40 years old. <laughs> he put his dick in the... <laughs> this game is disgusting. Putting glory holes in games, come on. Visit upgrades of the... Ho Excuse me? Excuse me? Upgrades? I, 
guys, you know what? I'm going to say it. I don't think these are kids' games anymore. I don't think you can consider these games for kids. So when I tell my mom later, hey, mom, I played the new Star Wars game, if she says, if she says, Chris, you got to grow up a little bit. She can catch some hands. You find something in the store you can't use, come back later. Yes. So these games are the basically the ultimate and maybe even the first Metroidvanias, to be honest with you. Oh god, he's killing all of our men. So now you guys are also wondering, besides upgrades, what else is all this money for? Um, so a lot of things. So in this game, you buy characters so that when you come back and do levels over, um, you can do those. You can do those missions. Um on top of uh buying cheats now cheats in this game actually help a lot um and those cheats aren't like oh like invinci well actually that's a lie there is invincibility and stuff but um yeah it, it just makes the game fun it makes the game fun eventually let's see build let's build it on this side first Ooh. is this usable am i technically empire i am Boom. Boom. Mini games? I don't, I don't live for this. Okay, what did that do? Oh, that's the airlock. Later, losers. No, 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 no. Ooh, that was close. Whoa. So I think that means that we did something that you didn't have to do, but we did it anyway. So we destroyed this. Wait, hold on, let's see, let's see real fast. You build it over here. What happens if I spray water at this? Does it... Oh, it makes something different. Whoa. I don't know the names of every... Like, I don't know the... The titles of... But I think you have the Empire, you have the... That's all I know. <laughs> the Rebels. Rebels is the other one. There we go. Truth is, I'm only playing this game so I can execute Order 66. Go look up what that is. <laughs> so this is one of the collectibles. God, I am too smart. <laughs> Boom! Mini kit. So these unlock uh, special uh, special uh, vehicles and stuff. Uh, they're basically the game's main collectible, uh, in my opinion. Except for, well, then you have golden bricks. But I don't know if there are golden bricks in this. Um, but, uh... Golden bricks, I mean, those build exceedingly rare items. But as I said, I will be 100%ing this game. We're so close. We're so close. Actually, I probably could get it right here. Level one completed, baby. Uh, Money-wise. Now, we're still going to keep collecting everything because uh, the money is super importante. True Jedi, let's go. Oh, so they put the plans in R2. I did not know that. So now we're R2-D2 and CP3-O. Wait, R2-D2 can attack now? Usually he just shocks things. Does CP3-O have like a jump attack? Or a gun of any type? God, useless. Get in there, CP3-O. Boarding party, skip, free play unlocked. True Jedi. Oh my god, I'm good. 
Sometimes I'm in all challenges. Sometimes I amaze myself. I didn't get that one. Okay. Skip. Two med kits. Or mini kits. Characters and ships unlocked. Okay. So the trick to this game, guys. Hold on. Let me pause real fast. Trick to this game and the way you should do it is complete all the main levels first. Usually by the time you get about halfway through the game, you at least have... A enough characters unlocked that you can do everything in the game which is usually about half so uh now we're in the Junland waste wastes and um now we're in like the open world aspect okay wait let's look at the map how big is the map <laughs> oh god Holy fuck, man. This is by far the biggest Lego game we've had. No! We've been shocked. Luke Skywalker. The man, the myth, the legend. Literally. Luke Skywalker, dude. Where's my, do I not have a lightsaber yet? Damn it. Now a little pro tip from a uh, professional Lego player. <laughs> God, that's so sad. If my mom was down here and she heard that, I mean, she would have kicked me out of the house. Definitely. Little pro tip is you want to find a character that does heavy AOE damage. Like one that has like an area of effect so that you can just blast through most of this stuff. What's wrong with him now? He says that the several creatures approaching sand people. Sand people. Pistol OP. Oh wow, there's actually headshot damage and stuff. Whoa, you can actually hit crits in Star Wars? Hello there. You're fortunate to be all in one piece. Thank you. Who? Ben Kenobi? Boy, am I glad to see you. So I punch him. Tell me, young Luke, what brings you out this far? This little droid. He tells me he's looking for his former master, Obi Wan Kenobi. Is he a relative of yours? Obi Wan. I feel like he's Obi-Wan Kenobi. I always thought he was Obi-Wan. Oh, okay. You fought in the Clone Wars? Yes, I was once a Jedi Knight, the same as your father. Which reminds me. How did my father die? Oh, right. What is it? Yeah. Your father's lightsaber. Now let's see if we can't figure out what you are, my little friend. Don't do that. General Kenobi, I have placed information General. vital to the survival of the rebellion into the memory systems of this R2 unit. My father will know how to retrieve it. You must see this droid safely delivered to him on Alderaan. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only help. Learn the ways of the force. I've got to get home. It's late. I'm in for it as it is. Maybe. Oh, I'm Emperor! There's nothing for me here now. I want to learn the ways of the force. <laughs> That's a quick change. Yeah, there we go. Luke's workshop. That would have bothered me if I didn't complete that. There's 11. Hundred, and I have six. <laughs> should inquire about the pilot and take us to all the land. All right, ask around. Uh, a what? A we don't serve pilots here. Isn't this Chewy right here? Someone who can help us get to all the land. We can pay. Why uh. fight? How's lightsaber feel, bud? Oh, that's right. This guy, Han Solo. You know, I'm starting to realize I know more about Star Wars than I thought. Chewie here tells me you're looking for passage to the Alderaan system. Yes, indeed. If it's a fast ship. She's fast enough for you, old man. What's the cargo? Only passengers. Myself, the boy, two droids. 
And no questions asked. Okay, you guys got yourselves a ship. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. Docking Bay 94. <laughs> Piece of junk. It may not look like much, but she's got it where it counts, kid. Chewie, what is this? I told you to get her ready. <laughs> a late lunch? We gotta be somewhere. Stop that ship. Huh? Uh. You're done, Zell. I'm going in, boys. Cover me. Can I build this? Is there something I can build here? Looks like it. Make the electrical trap. We'll leave that there for when they start coming in again. This can go up to here. <coughs> yeah, <coughs> it's working. Hold to pick up the target object by force. And that definitely did not work, but we, we attempted. So we want to move outward. Yep. Damn. The force is strong with this one. I'm sorry. Too easy. This is this is the ultimate spawn camp. That's what I thought. Get the get out of here. I will get true Jedi. Oh, don't do that. Oh, I can throw my lightsaber. I love it, dude. They put everything in this game, and I really appreciate it. And I'm not even a Star Wars fan, dude. Whoa! Uh-uh. No! <laughs> Get me back up! I just went on a killing spree, dude. Get in the ship! Oh. What are you doing, look? Looks like we're coming up on Alderaan. What? Where is it? Destroyed by the Empire. Oh, it doesn't exist anymore. He's heading for that small moon. Uh, that's no moon. It's a space station. Uh, we're caught in a tractor beam. It's pulling us in. No one on board, sir. Send a scanning crew aboard. I want every part of this ship checked. Yes, sir. I sense something. A presence I have not felt since. Huh? He senses Obi-Wan, but he doesn't sense his own son. This is Spoilers. Even if I could take off, I'd never get past the tractor beam. Leave that to me. Sweet. Okay, guys, we are on the Death Star. That's where I'm going to end it. Uh, I'm probably about an hour 30, hour 40 in. And let me tell you, this is obviously a game that I'm going to complete. Um, I skipped probably about 90% of the uh, side missions that we could have done already. But, guys, this is a massive, massive game content-wise, right? You have nine movies to go through, 23 planets, right, in the, in the universe, 1,100 collectibles just for bricks. That's not even mid-kits. That's not even – or mini-kits. That doesn't even factor in, like – I mean, characters, ships to buy, like, oh my god, just, like, it's overwhelming to think about, but let me tell you, your boy's gonna 100% this game, but yeah, $50, I mean, if you're looking for a game that you're gonna put 100 hours into, uh, and one, um, 
that's a lot of fun. This is it. This is the game, especially if you're a Star Wars fan. Um, but as I said, this is going to be my regular game uh, when I have the time. And, uh, yeah, there's really not much else to say. It's very good. So I will leave a link in the description down below for those of you that do want to try it out, as well as social media, promo codes, and streaming links down below. And hopefully you guys still enjoyed this video, and hopefully I will see you in the next one in a stream. So peace, peace.